Hey, welcome to another video. Today we're going to talk about a new gear that I have, this unit right here, which is the Tegar Tegar, the Magnetismus 2. I know you guys saw this unit on the side here. It's been here for two months now. I was actually looking for the audio creme and uh, it's actually in production right now. So they, they were really kind to send me this and to try it out and to make a review on it. It's a very interesting machine and it sounds very unique as well. So I'm going to run you through it just so you know what this has. So it has a compressor here on the side. Uh, it's a VCA class A. You have your threshold, attack and release just in one knob. It goes from fast to slow. Okay, you have your ratio right here and you can turn it off if you want to bypass this section. So already you have uh, a unique feature right here where you can just bypass the compressor and just use this side. Okay, now on this side you have your gain knob right here where you can drive the signal making that perceived loudness to be louder. Drive that signal into here, you get that saturation which is, you know, a bit like tape saturation. So you get that from this knob right there then you have the intensity, which then it makes that, it adds a bit more saturation. So you can increase that saturation with the intensity right there. And then you have these three options. And you can choose between them. They have three different colors that you can choose from. Also, the shape of the transients will be a bit different. So I think this is marketed as a transient shaper. But really, that's that's the thing about this machine is that it's much more than a transient shaper. You can really do a lot with it. So I could use just the compressor if I want or just use this section right here and add some gain or add some saturation, really destroy the sound with the intensity here if I want. I can use it on the full mix or just use it on some samples, the bass, the drums, just on individual tracks. So I'm going to just show you some of my instrumentals. What I've been having a lot of fun with it is running my electronic boom bap beats through it. You know, I'm going to oversaturate things so you can also listen to the sounds, but I wouldn't use it in an extreme way. I would, I'm always using it in a very gentle way just to grab some of that saturation, compress it a little bit. I actually like my stuff compressed really hard sometimes, but that's just preference. Let's let's see how it sounds. Let, let's hear it. Hopefully you guys love this unit as much as I do.
That was it. I hope you guys enjoyed the Magnetismus. I tried to play you a little bit of drums, a little bit of a bass, but mostly I like to use it on my master output. Even though it seems like a very simple machine with just a few knobs, you can really create so many diverse sounds and you can put it just on your drums if you want. I'm actually going to run a lot of snares through this, add some distortion to the snares, a bit of distortion to the kicks, create a packs from this machine. If you're into this type of hip hop, go check my other channel because I have another channel on the side, which I haven't done much to be honest on. And, uh, but that's where I'm going to be uploading my electronic boom bap, electronic hip hop in the future. I really want to start putting everything over there and just make different type of videos for that channel. I'm going to keep it more vinyl on this one and then just everything that's electronics it's going to go into that one follow it i'll leave it in the um, in the description so you guys can check it out just subscribe to that nothing else to say i hope you guys enjoyed the the machine magnetismus thank you once again to tigler uh thank you so much for sending in the product um hopefully in the future i will review your creme uh, which everyone talks so good about and that's it i'll see you on the next video peace